So your next question is minimize the following function for product of sum. Okay, using K map and realize it by using basic gates. So f of a comma b comma c comma d is equal to it is given pi m. So product of sum, uh, product of max terms is equal no, of zero comma one comma six comma eight comma eleven comma twelve and d of three comma seven comma four comma fifteen. So you have to solve it using product of sum. So what? How can you draw your K map? Variables are a, b, c, d. So what will be your value? 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So since it is product of sum or your max terms, in the place of 0, 1, 6, 8, you are going to add, you are going to give the value as 0. Okay. So for 0, it is 0. For 1, it is 0. For 6, it is 0. For 8, it is 0. For 11, it is 0. Where is 11? 11 it is 0 and for 12 it is 0 okay so since it is max term you have completed all the 0 then you have to add your don't care so don't care is equal to 3 7 4 15 so 3 7 where is your 6 7 4 15 okay so are your don't care now can you group group together so you have these four can be grouped together these four can be grouped together this two zeros can be grouped and here you want you have one zero left right so that can be grouped with that of your adjacent side so what are the values you one two three four you will be getting four factors so it has to be expressed in product of sum okay so product of the sum value so for example if we take the first factor so in this case if we take what will be the value a bar plus so here it is Product of sum means it is opposite to that of your sum of product, right? So 0, 0 means usually you will take it as A bar, B bar. But in this case, you are going to take it as A, B. And this product of sum. So the product of A plus B. So you will be getting A plus B. And what is this value? 0, 0. So A plus B plus C. Okay. So you have to take the complement. So A plus B plus C. So this will be your first value. Okay. A plus B plus C a plus b plus c so let us take the second one so here it is zero so uh, you will be taking it as a a b bar so a plus b bar plus so these two values zero and one will get cancelled you have zero so a plus b bar plus d that will be your, giving your second factor so this is a plus b bar plus d now what will be your third value into what is your this we have left right so what is the value here it is c d so it will be c bar plus d bar okay c bar plus d bar and what is your fourth one which is left back it is here you have right so these four uh, so here it is c bar d bar so you here you will be getting c plus d okay so you have got y is equal to z bar plus d bar c plus d into a plus b bar plus d into a plus b plus c so this can be converted into a logic diagram can be drawn logic diagram using your basic gate so a b c d so here you will be getting b bar c bar d bar so what is your first factor c bar plus d bar so you are going to use an or gate for sum and your and gate finally for your multiplication so c bar plus d bar second one will be c plus d third one will be a plus b bar plus d and fourth one will be a plus b plus c which will give will be given to your and gate and you will be getting your output